Hey, what up, superstars? It's your boy. I bet on me with some more Destiny 2 content. Hey, got another great video for you guys today on regarding how to get the Xeno Class 4 Legendary Shotgun and a God Roll Guide for the Xeno Class 4 for PvP and PvE. And this weapon just made its way into Destiny 2 Beyond Light. And if you missed out on the Fair Winner's Light Shotgun, you definitely want to get your hands on this because it feels like a mini Fair Winner's Light. But right before we get into it, if you guys do like great Destiny 2 content regarding PvP and PvE, weapon reviews, how-to videos, subclass builds, great gameplay, a little bit of Destiny 2 news and Destiny 1, this is definitely the channel for you, so go ahead and click that sub and notification bell, and it definitely helps support the channel. Now you could get this weapon as a random drop after playing Vanguard Strikes. Now this shotgun is lightweight frame, superb handling, move faster with this weapon equipped, and it's 80 rounds per minute, 6 in the magazine, and this is the same archetype as the 7 Seraph CQC-12. And this weapon has good impact, range, and handling. And this weapon has so many God Roll traits that I'm pretty sure this is going to replace my 7 Seraph shotgun. Now for your PvP God Roll, like I said, this weapon has a lot of God Roll traits, so it just really depends on your playstyle. But the better ones, in my opinion, has an arrow by it. If it's the best, in my opinion, it has the first place sticker. And if it has fire by it, that means that's a brand new trait into Destiny 2 that has the opportunity to be a God Roll trait. So in line number one, it's a tie between Rifle Barrel, which add plus 10 to range, minus 15 to handling, and Full Choke. Titan Barrel reduces projectile spread when aiming down sight at the cost of precision damage. And in line number two, it's a toss-up between Assault Mag, which add plus 15 to stability, and it increases your rate of fire by plus 10 rounds per minute, and also accurized rounds, which add plus 10 to your range. Now in line number three, we got two new traits. One is Dual Loader, reloads two shells at a time but it reduces your reload speed and we have surplus increased handling reload speed and stability for each fully charged ability and also the best is going to be slide shot sliding partially reloads this weapon magazine and temporarily boosts range and stability and i wish at this point they would have had something like opening shot or quick draw but this is slide shot is still really good now in line number four uh, is going to be a toss-up between rampage which to me is the best kills with this weapon temporarily grand increase damage and it stacks up times three and then you also have killing win which is good final blows grant increased mobility range and handling for a short duration and like i say this uh in line number four is so many guy roll traits it really just depends on your preference but those are the better ones in my opinion now for PVE in line number one, small bore, add plus seven to range, plus seven to stability. Also corkscrew rifling, add plus five to range, plus five to handling, plus five to stability. Line number two, you have assault mag again, but also tactical mag. It increases stability by plus five, magazine plus 10, reload speed by plus 10. Line number three, slide shot again, but also field prep. It increases ammo reserves, faster reload, stow, and ready when you're crouched. And you also have auto loading holster. The holster weapon is automatically reloaded after a short period of time. And then in line number four, Rampage again. But then you also have Vorpal Weapon. Increased damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians when their super is active. And then you have Swashbuckler. This weapon gains increased damage from melee kills and kills with this weapon. And it perks times five instantly when you do a melee. So in the comments, let me know what role you're going to be farming for. So until next time, this your boy, that don't mean saying peace. Hope to see you guardians in the Destiny universe. Let's team up and have some fun. You guys have a blessed day.